Hello and welcome to another PB Reviews. We have November's Degusta box, which, as you can see from the outside here, it seems to have a Christmassy theme, which is quite nice. I guess the uh, December one might not arrive until after Christmas, so always good to be prepared. And in fact, yes, uh, I don't think you can't really see, because I can't tip the whole box over, but it's got a little sticker on top where it closes saying Merry Christmas. It's a nice touch. If you've seen my other videos, you'll know what to expect from the top. Let me just turn this round a bit and you can see the other side of the box. We have leaflets detailing all the bits and pieces that are inside the box. Um, various bits and pieces, not as much as before and no kind of um, discount vouchers, which is a shame. But we shall have a look and see what goodies are inside. I have to move this out of the way a bit more. First of all, crisps, my favourite. Piper's crisps, Atlas Mountains, wild pine and rosemary. Something slightly different, very kind of festive -y. And we have, they love me so well, popcorn. We've had popcorn of various different kinds in, in the last few boxes actually, but this is probably one of my favourite, butterkiss sweet. Anything um, new? Uh, no. It's normal butterkiss, which no complaining. I love butterkiss. I'm talking of popcorn. Choco Mellow flavoured popcorn. That is going to go very fast. Once my kids see that we've got Choco Marshmallow flavoured popcorn, there's not going to be any left. So I'm going to have to save those for movie night. Wonderful. <laughs> Uh, and to carry on the theme of kind of comfort food, we have butter crisps, which are, I think we've had something like this in the past. But butter crisps are lovely, they're like little kind of crispy waffle biscuits. Nice. Okay, next item, something thins. It is sweet chilli flatbreads. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. That's kind of dip or um, some like dairy loo or something or, or Philadelphia on those. Oh, this is something new. Oh, hollandaise sauce. Do you know, I've never tried hollandaise sauce. I don't even know what's in it. I'm sure someone can tell me. Butter and lemon juice. Oh, okay. Yeah, so for like fish and things. So next time we have fish, I'm going to try it. I, that's why I like these, um, these boxes, because sometimes you get things that you've never tried before, and it's an excuse to just try them and, and have something really nice that you suddenly find that you really love. And talking you really love, we have little dark chocolate with a pinch of sea salt cookies. There we go. With a cool little cartoon on the front of them. They look really nice. I should try them. So everything so far has been brilliant. And crunchy slam dunk peanut chunk. So it's um snack. There we go, with peanuts in. Again, looks brilliant. Lunchtime job I think for one of us whoever gets there first and we have ooh, some bottles now, are they going to be alcoholic bottles they are and it's my favorite type of alcohol other than wine which is cider so this is the good cider of San Sebastian wild berry cider and it looks like it's French so it should be interesting there we go Leave that one there and have a look at this one. Is it the same or is it a different flavour? Strawberry. Nice. Is that strawberry and something else? It's got it's strawberries but it's got pictures of limes on it, so that's quite interesting. It's probably got lime in as well. Lovely. Put those to the side. I'll enjoy those later. Hartley's raspberry flavoured jelly. New. So jelly crystals, I haven't seen jelly crystals in years. Everyone just buys those chunks of jellies and separates them out, which is quite good when you're under stress to pull chunks of jelly, but jelly crystals is quite nice. And this has, just reading through it, bear with me a minute. 
doesn't look like any artificial sweeteners, which is good. The last ones we had, uh, little pops of jelly, and they had artificial sweeteners, and I, I personally, if it's too much sweetener, I can taste it in the aftertaste, and it's, I just can't get on with them, so really good to see this one, doesn't it? But jelly crystals, we can make that for the kids. We've got some jelly moulds somewhere I can, I can do some things with. Ah, another bottle. J2O. Oh, oh, we've had this before. My youngest daughter loves this stuff. It's glitter berry. It's like normal J2O, but it's got glitter in it. I don't know if you can see on the camera. Can't really see very well, but basically it's like gold glitter inside the, uh, the drink. And it's actually quite a nice drink as well. And we have another jelly, and this one is mixed berry jelly. I didn't realise actually, well on this one it's harder to tell, but there's actually glitter jelly. So it's got glitter in it. So not only do we have jelly, it's perfect for the festive season, but we've got jelly with glitter in. That's just gonna be brilliant. Kids will love it. And I think it's possibly the final thing, which is slightly open, but that's fine. I think it's just been squashed down in the box. Rivita spiced apple chutney flavoured crackers. Perfect again for this time of year. Excellent. I love crackers with cheese, which is lovely. I uh, just need a bottle of wine to go with it. But yeah, crackers and cheese, there we go. Fantastic. Four packs of those. We're munching our way through those. And we do have a couple of little bits and pieces at the bottom here. We have got a nice little kind of Christmas card. Oh, that's nice. Wishing you Merry Christmas. This is the kind of thing you get from Dexter Box. And gift label tags. Brilliant. So it's just nice bits and pieces in addition. And that's all we have in the box. You can see the box there. Oh, if you can see around there. They, they always protect it really well. So you've got bottles and stuff, so you'll be really good. So yeah, that is probably the best box we've had so far from Degusta Box. I think the whole family is going to really enjoy this and, um, yeah, very festive. <laughs> so I'm sure I'll see you again in December and um, have fun if you've got a Degusta Box to open. If you haven't, check out the comments. Um, there should be, if I can put it in, a code where you can get £7 off a Degusta Box, the first one. Uh, it helps me as well because I get money off of mine, um, so it helps everyone really, and you can get all these wonderful things for a very small amount of money. Thank you very much, thank you for Degusta Box for sending another excellent bunch of stuff, and thank you for watching, so see you on the next one. Bye! <laughs>